Hi everybody, this is Scott Snyder from Sundial and this is another one of my developer discussion videos. This is the second video uh, for my custom agent that I'm writing for a client and I've added a bunch of new features here. Again on the left we have the manager screen and on the right we have the agent screen. Here on the manager screen I've added some buttons for formatting and also to go through the script parts quickly. Uh, save, bold, italic, underline, increase, decrease font size, change the font color, left, center, and right alignment, and so on. I've also added the ability, I've added the a right click with help, which is actually the key help for the shortcuts, and I've added something to toggle the formatting symbols, so you can actually see, like this paragraph symbol here, how the formatting is, which is kind of cool, just like Word. And I've added the ability to import a document. You can actually import a Word document into any of these script parts, which could be pretty handy if somebody's you know writing up something in Word and you want to uh, import it in. Here you can also insert an image. Next, on the Manage Products tab, I've added two new tables. I've added a color table, product colors table, and a product sizes table. And this will let the agents select the color and size and keep it consistent. And I'll go ahead and show you that here. I'm going to simulate a connect and here you can see I have size, extra extra large, color, red, quantity, and let's see a knife. Let's get a huge knife that's blue and we probably need three of them and so on. Now you notice here also on the agent screen I have added scrolling. These are actually dynamically created group and group boxes and rich text boxes, which is going to open up a lot of flexibility. At some point, I'm probably going to have little small embedded web uh, browser objects that you can put on the page so you can have custom forms also that are generated in the script generator. may have mentioned that before. Uh, rebuttals are added are on a second tab, and they're, they're still there. And when we're done, we can just hit done and hit a disposition go back to be ready. Now here on this export tab you can say get records and you'll see this is the export in the format that the client has requested or pretty close I'm hoping and we have everything we need the interval, the size, the color and so on. And as usual I'm adding, adding a, uh, a live trace and you can send this to Sundial support if there's any issues and, it, and we will get a copy of it. I'm also going to add the same thing to the agent screen so while we're testing the, the agent uh, initially, we'll be, I'll be able to get feedback quickly. Anyway, that's about it. I'm looking for feedback as normal. Thank you, and have a nice day.